Devin Walker here at 2019 Memphis Football Media Days. And I'm Megan Triplett. Yes, she is Megan Triplett. And this is JoJo Dorsey, is the man in the middle. How you feeling, my brother? I'm feeling great. Excited about camp. Uh, I'm ready to get my hands back on some office alignment, so... <laughs> okay. All right. So the big question is, what are you listed as for your position going into the year? Because we know you can play a lot of positions. So fullback, defensive tackle. What are we doing? Athlete. What are we? Where are we going? I think they just got it listed as D line, even though you know I'm a lot more versatile than that. <laughs> so that's we're gonna start with D line. And are we gonna see you score a touchdown this year? I'm looking forward to it. That's always a big play that um, everybody wants to have. Mm -hmm. So. If I have the opportunity to present itself, I'm going to take full advantage of it. Okay, we know you guys love your music here, around here. So what's what's been on your summer playlist? What song have you added to your summer playlist this, this time around? I'm from New Orleans, so I listen to Lil Wayne a lot. There's been, Wayne, there been no New Wayne out. Uh, it don't have to be no New Wayne. He dropped, oh. enough, he dropped enough material, you know what I'm saying, that could last a lifetime. So, so what's your go-to Lil Wayne song? The whole Carter Five album. I'm gonna just say that. The whole album. So from start to finish, you rocking with it. Okay. Is that the Louisiana loyalty, or is this? Is you actually you rocking with the album? I mean, I feel like um, it's some people that's from New Orleans that that branch out a little bit. But I'm just, I just, you know, I, mean, I don't think no, that's another rapper better than Lil Wayne. So that's what I'll be listening to. All right. So you, we're here in Memphis, Tennessee. Something that's big is barbecue. What's your go-to order if you're gonna go to any barbecue spot? I'm gonna go to Tony Paul and them barbecue spot. And I'm just gonna get whatever she suggests. <laughs> whatever. Yes. Smart strategy. Mm-hmm. Yes, ma'am. All right, who, we're gonna go down your list of teammates right now. We went to your best dressed teammate. Who is the funniest teammate on the squad? Funniest teammate on the squad. I think I'm gonna have to go with um, Giant Tate. That's the second time we've heard that one. I'm gonna have to go with Giant Tate. I don't know. It's some a dude just it's just natural. Comedian. Is he checking people? What is he doing? Cracking jokes? What is he what makes him so fun? I'm gonna have to go on a yeah, honorable mention though, uh Braylon Brown. That's one of the uh he's from Memphis actually. Um he one of the um another one of the I guess the funniest unit is D line. So if it ain't first, second, we probably got first, second, third, fourth funniest people on the team. All right. If you're stranded on an island and you can only bring one thing with you, what is that going to be? Uh, I don't one thing. Just one thing. Because you think about it, if you bring your phone, it could die. You don't have a charger. Right. So, bring one thing with you. I think I'm going to, um, if I could bring one thing, it'll be a lighter. Um, okay. Lighter. Okay. Oh, you're you can light it. the wood. Yeah, you know? yeah. You can light the wood. Okay. Cool. Yeah. That's an answer we haven't heard. To be honest with you. All right. So you play video games at all? Are you a video game player? What's your favorite video game? I got a couple. Um, I'm I'm more of sports. So Madden, you know, 2K stuff like that. But um, I play Call of Duty too. Okay. All right. Okay. So. Speaking of football games. Yeah. You go ahead. Yeah. So the college football game. Of course, we know it doesn't exist anymore, but if we were to make a JoJo Dorsey's character on the game, what would be the highest rated attribute on that video game? Highest rated attribute? Yeah. Awareness. Okay. <laughs> Acceleration. That's two, but okay. That works. <laughs> those, those would probably be equal. They'll probably both be like a 95 or something. All right, so season's right around the corner. What can we look forward to in that first game against Ole Miss? Energy. Swagger. Um... A lot of uh, love um, being spread between the team because we, you know, we uh, congratulate each other. We love when everybody um, just doing great. So it's not about one person, it's about the team. So you're going to see a lot of guys flying around, making plays, and a lot of, you know, love. All right, that's it here from Memphis Football Media Days with JoJo Dorses.